In this video, we will learn all the different ways you can add leads on reference. Basically, there are three ways you can add leads on reference. One, add individual leads manually. Two, upload multiple leads in bulk. And three, automatically capture leads via the sense form. So let's get started. One, adding individual leads manually. Let's say we have a new lead who is looking for content writing services. To add this lead manually, we will go to lead management from the sidebar and click on add new lead icon. Now we will add all the details such as the lead's name, contact details, organization and designation. In the lead subject, we can write content writing service. We can also add additional detail if needed. For example, let's write the lead requires content for Instagram post, reels and website prompts. Next, in the select pipeline field, you will see all the sales pipelines you have created in your account. Just select a pipeline that is most relevant to your lead. To know more about what a pipeline is and how to create a new one, check the link in the description. Depending on the stage of your interaction with the lead, you can select Open, Contact It, Proposal Sent, etc. to better track the deal progress. You can also add lead labels to quickly categorize and sort out leads with a particular label. You can either select from the default labels or edit or create new ones from here. If you would like to capture more information about the leads, you can do that with custom fields. To create custom fields for capturing additional lead data, click on Edit Pipeline in which you want to add custom fields and click on Add New Field under Custom Fields. As you can see, you can create custom fields with various formats like multi-line text, currency, boolean, URL, and then. For example, in this product photographic pipeline, I have needed custom fields to capture additional information like company URL and multi slit checkboxes for services required. To edit these custom fields, go to the business settings, select lead management system and click on pipeline custom fields. I will select my product photography needs. Here, you can modify the custom fields as per your need. But if you want to change the custom field details of some particular lead, you can do that from the custom field section in the lead new page. Two, bulk uploading leads. If you want to move your lead data from another sales CRM or from an Excel sheet, you can do it easily with the bulk upload feature. Let's see how. To upload leads in bulk, you need to first decide which pipeline you want the leads to go into. For example, I want to upload leads in my product photographic pipeline. I can do that by clicking on the view leads button. Then click on the drop down of add leads and select bulk upload leads. To ensure that you are following the right format, first download the sample file. As you can see, the sample file will include several fields such as lead source, contact details, follow-up date, assignment, etc. It's okay if you don't fill in all the fields, but five fields, that is contact name, subject, budget, currency, and lead stage are mandatory to be filled for a successful bulk upload. Before you upload the lead state of reference, there are four things you need to take care of. Number one, lead format. Here is the list of all the valid date formats. If you also want to add the follow-up time along with the date, you can use the formats like the ones shown on the screen. Two, lead stage. Only use lead stages that are already there in your sales pipeline. If you want to upload leads with new stages, First, add them to your sales pipeline and then upload the CSO file. 3. Assign me. In the assign me column, only add the email IDs of the users who are already added to your license account. And 4. File fault. Only CSV files are supported for bulk upload. Uploading the CSV file. Once your CSV file is ready, click on Choose File and upload your CSV. After you upload the file, two things can happen. A. If you have invalid data in the CSV file, you will get an error report. Download the error report to see what errors are there in your CSV file. Re-upload the file after rectifying the errors. Contact support if you require any help. B. 
If your CSV file does not have any errors, you will see a confirmation modal. Click on Upload file to finish the upload. You'll find all your uploaded leads here. And if you have added a custom field to your sales pipeline, you can also include this additional data in your CSV file for bulk upload. Follow the same process mentioned earlier to upload leads in bulk. Remember to match the column names in your CSV file with the custom field names you've added. You will also receive a confirmation email once all leads have been successfully uploaded. Automatically capture leads via license forms. If you want to automatically capture leads from your website, social media, and other platforms, you can do that with license forms. Additionally, you can also add UTM parameters to your license form links to get detailed insights into your lead source, campaign, and media. You can find this under the campaign details section on the lead view page. For a detailed tutorial on license forms, click on the link in description. That's it. Now you know how easy it is to add leads on the reference.